Well, hello everybody. This is Street Alt Laws No Prep Talk. Today we're going to talk about Ryan Martin's Phoenix having a testing incident in Australia. Now, photo going to go directly to their photo owners. Please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Street Alt Laws No Prep Kings Trace series and all the other Street Alt Law shows. So, it's currently night time in Australia. So, a couple of hours ago, Ryan Martin was involved in a testing incident in his Phoenix small tire Camaro. Now, apparently he was in a really good pass and he hit the wall. So, uh, car got pretty well damaged, but Ryan is okay, which is obviously the most important thing. But we do not know the extent of the damage on Phoenix. Now, first of all, I think it really sucks for Ryan and Ryan is probably the fastest car on small tires that they're running right now over there in behalf of the U.S. Street Outlaws. So they're going to be down a car for this weekend. Now, as you may see from this picture, which credit goes to whoever took it. I do not know uh, exactly who took it, but credit goes to that person. It does have some front end damage. The whole... Uh, carbon fiber i believe front end got destroyed it probably needs some uh, front end work as well some front end chassis work front half work but other than that the car seems to be pretty good <clears throat> i believe the tumi's got the uh, damage as well even though they don't really look like they got really broken and probably the pro charger is broken as well but other than that it doesn't seem to be a serious issue thankfully and obviously the car can get repaired. Now, will they repair it in Australia? Who knows? I mean, there are several chassis shops down there that build some pretty badass cars. So maybe he can get some help from the Australians. That would be really cool to see this car get fixed and get get it running before the next three races. So I believe anything is possible and Ryan for sure can get it done. So, hell, he might get it done in another country, for what it's worth. But uh, I believe he's going to get it fixed. Hopefully, he finds the right people in Australia so he can get this car fixed. I don't know, as I've just said, the extent of the damage, but it just doesn't seem to be a lot. And, hey, it happens. I mean, when you race these cars long enough and they go this fast, at some point... Everybody's going to crash. I mean, it just happens. So, uh, sadly, this time was Ryan Martin that crashed, but he is doing fine. And the car doesn't seem to be uh, seriously damaged. So, hopefully he can get it fixed as soon as possible. And we can see him run in Australia. If not, he will get it fixed here in the U.S. And we will see this car back out really, really soon.